So somebody asked me a good question. As a fresher, what to choose? Full stack developer versus data scientist versus data analyst versus AI engineer versus ML engineer. More job openings. Where have more job openings? So first of all, before you decide to make any broad choice like that vis-a-vis -vis your development career, your coding career, what you should do is learn the fundamentals. Because right now, if you're a fresher, you're a noob, you know nothing or very little about the whole space, meaning the whole industry, it's very, very difficult, if not impossible, for you to decide what is best for you. That's the key. In any of these particular specializations in development, they're all uh, very, 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 very fruitful. They're all, they all offer, offer many opportunities, good salaries, good, uh, good pay, etc. They're all good. But you have to figure out which one is good for you because each one of these specializations in the, we'll call it the development space, they require different skill sets, different personality types. So for example, full stack developer is more of a generalist versus a data scientist. Data scientist, AI engineer, they will be, uh, they will be classically more, in, or more nerdish for lack of better terms, more math oriented, where it's not necessarily math, but except, well, AI, AI development in terms of developing AIs is very math intense as far as I understand. I'm not, I'm not an expert in AI, but as I've mentioned in recent videos, I think most of the jobs related to AI will be in the AI implementation, using AI as opposed to developing AI. But you can go watch my previous videos found on this channel uh, where I talk about that. So before I would jump into trying to figure out whether it be full stack, data scientists, et cetera, and so on and so forth, learn the fundamentals of coding so that you can come into it, you can look at it with nerd eyes, you know, with an understanding of what it is you're looking at. It's kind of like dating. You date to figure out what type of partner, what type of person, what type of individual you want to date. You may have in your mind's eye some vague conception of what it is, but until you really date a whole bunch of people, you start getting a feel for you know, an extrovert or this or that, you know, then you get a, only then will you really understand what you like, what you don't like. I don't know if that's the greatest analogy. How about cars? You're buying cars. Do you want a sports car? Do you want a convertible? Do you want a rear, rear wheel drive? Uh, do you want an SUV, et cetera, and so on? Some of these decisions may be obvious up front. Some of them may be uh, only revealed to you once you actually jump into a bunch of cars and start driving around. When it comes to coding, though, and development, it's, it's far more important than driving cars or dating in terms of, like, there's so, much, there's so much nuance in the different specializations, full stack versus front end versus data scientists, AI development, et cetera. There's so much nuance that only someone with nerd eyes, with a, at least a, an understanding of the fundamentals, only with somebody with those nerd eyes will be able to, to discern whether or not, um, or which specialization that they want to go into. So there you go. I think the best analogy is actually video games. That, that's the best one. Do you like first person shooters? Do you like third person uh, shooters? Do you like MMOs? You know, whatever. You don't really know until you jump into it. So jump into it. That's my recommendation. If you're looking at all this, don't worry about it. First rule of learning development is you, you, you are not wasting your time no matter what you do. So let's say you jump into this and you start learning Python because you're thinking, I want to become uh, an AI expert. So you learn Python and you jump into, I think it's called TensorFlow, and you learn how to do your basic interactions with AI, and then you discover, eh, AI is not for me. Did you waste all your time learning Python? No, not at all. Because all the time and effort you put into learning Python, all those skills, that understanding, which is most important, that understanding you got from learning Python, understanding of coding in general, all of that's 100% transferable to data science, to a full stack developer, to even, even to front end, believe it or not, even though you don't use Python on the front end. So you cannot waste your time learning. As I say, the more you learn, the more you earn. There are so many things I've learned in the past that have nothing to do with coding or making videos, but uh, well, at least not directly, but those 
experiences, that skill has come to uh, help me quite a bit in terms of putting content out. For example, I've spent a lot of time working on uh, martial arts, on music, on business, and a whole bunch of other subjects on diet, nutrition, out of necessity there. And uh, even though you'd figure, what does that have to do with coding? It's had a huge impact in terms of my perceptions of things, in terms of my ability to speak to coding, speak to career, speak to uh, this quality of life, which people appreciate on this channel for the most part. All right, that's pretty much it. I hope you found this video useful. If you have any questions or comments about anything I discussed here or anywhere else, uh, or anything else really, rather, uh, put it in the comments below. Uh, my name is Steph. Some people call me Uncle Steph. I have a boot camp mentoring program. It's kind of a boot camp, but I like to call it a mentoring program because it's totally different from any other boot camp out there. Uh, two major reasons, although there's many, many other reasons, but the number one reason is that with my mentoring, you're actually learning from somebody who has a proven track record of nearly three decades in the industry. So that's huge. I'm transferring my decades of knowledge to you guys so you don't have to spend uh, decades picking up all of it, on all of this stuff. You'll learn it much more quickly. And um, it teaches much more than just code. It teaches much more than just code. Uh, it teaches you how to manage your mind, how to manage money, how to manage projects, how to learn effectively more quickly. Anyway, there's much more to it if you want to check it out. UncleSteph.com. All right. We'll talk soon. Bye-bye.